Hey gamers, it's Wintermute here from Grind This Game. Back with Oxygen Not Included, the uh, Ranching Upgrade Mark II. And I didn't cheat, but I did see when I loaded up the game here that we do have a shine bug. I thought they had gone extinct, but there was one in here. That's probably in the last episode. Uh, I didn't notice it before. But I'm not going to try to lure him all the way down into the base. I'm going to tr try and wait until he lays an egg. Because then we can move the egg without trying to lure him all the way down here. It could be really tough. And into the room that we need him in. So that's one little project. We'll keep an eye on him. And we'll keep exploring as well. Because there, be, there might be more hidden away here. I'll probably try to explore in here. Oh, there's some chlorine in there. Probably don't want to go in there. Maybe I'll come across this way. Got bleach stone. Polluted water stuck in there. Okay. Uh, actually, we can go across this way. It's okay if we let hydrogen out. Let's do priority seven dig. Uh, that's no good. <laughs> Try that again. Okay. Up. Up one from there. Go that way. That should work. They're going to need a way to walk through that, though. So let's use granite. Oh, these are in the way. Okay, get rid of those. And I should probably speed the game up. Might as well smooth this out so it's kind of nice and flat. And we might as well make a little tunnel here. Okay, so there's that little project. Uh, what else can we do here? I kind of hit a bit of a snag here that the natural oh the polluted water is being used up and the natural gas pressure in here is now 15.8 kilograms so I put some automation on here there's a liquid shutoff valve that's connected to an atmos switch here so sorry if uh, if the pressure is below 2000 it uh, shuts this basically shuts off the, the flow of water. Sorry, if it's above. It's the reverse of this. Basically, if it's high pressure in here, it won't work. If we swap this, then it'll kick in, start using our blue water. And actually, I'm gonna leave it on for a bit because we need some fertilizer. We're out of fertilizer. But we need to use, uh, use more of this power. So I'm thinking of putting in another kind of floor here and a transformer. Stick that there. Get the heavy watt wire down. And then run a third circuit with conductive wire. Kind of down this way. Okay, that's in the way. <laughs> I guess I'll have to just bend around it, compounding the problem. So we got a bunch of coal and stuff down here. We can power all this with uh, this new line. All this stuff, all this stuff. Okay, we need conductive bridges. Someone was complaining about my doing priority eight all over the place. But I want it done right away, so. It seems to work for me. I haven't had any problems with it yet. Could probably use another smart battery to buffer this just a bit better. And extend our automation. 
over that way. So the fertilizer is going down here for our little sage hatches, which is making coal for us. And I was actually going to put some fertilizer in here as well. But I don't want 20,000 kilograms. Let's just set that really, really low. Oh, it already, it already is set. Okay. This has a higher, higher priority though, so it'll fill this up and then if there's any overflow, it'll go here. Now someone told me about an interesting bug. Uh, if you take a... A... Oh, these guys... Yeah, if you take a... Sh one of these guys that's already shaved and you wrangle him... Let's do a priority 9. And his drop-off is right here. So we'll wrangle him and then someone will drop him back off. And the bug is that he'll have his scales back. So it's a infinite plastic bug. If someone comes and gets him. See, he's got his skills back. So you could just do that over and over and over and get unlimited plastic. It's a little bit slow. But I won't be I won't be abusing that that bug. And our oxygen we don't really have a lot of oxygen flowing to this. Okay, these are all missing slime. Let's dig this out. Not as high priority, but might as well get some slime out of here. Oh, we got algae over there. Lots of hydrogen, I mean, lots of hydrogen in the way there. What do I have in here? Everything. Oh, that was to clean out this tank. Okay, so last episode... We were, oh, let's copy these mushrooms first. Last episode I was setting up the oil refinery and this was gonna be our petroleum tank, which is all abyssalite sealed. And I extended the piping and the power so that when it's ready, we can start using the petroleum. So all we need to do, I think, is connect up this last bit of pipe. So let's do an abyssalite. Uh, right here. That should bring the oil up. This is running off coal power. So that comes all the way up here. And the reason I built it up here was that the dupes have to come down and manually run these things. And I didn't want them going all the way to the bottom. So it's pretty close to the base. So they get in their suits, slide down the pole, get to work. And this will accumulate natural gas eventually, so we'll have to pump it out. And I'll deal with that once we get some pressure building up in there. Someone's going to build this. Yep, here we go. So that oil should start to flow. There it goes. Make sure I have my automation all set up here properly. Yep. Yep. What are these guys doing over here? Grabbing meat. Oh, some stuff died in there. Okay, let's crack that open. Get that egg. So I have an incubator right in... Oh, we got our larvae. Oh, he's so cute. Listen to him. Oh, man. Tiny baby. Slickster larvae. Okay, so we're not gonna... We're not gonna... Uh, ranch them, because once they're... Once they're... Kind of tamed, they require way more CO2. So I might just keep them wild. And how do we... How do we get a molten slickster? Molten slicksters make petroleum, which would be really cool to make. Body temperature between 100 and 250. They're really warm. It doesn't say... Well, they all eat CO2, so... It's just going to be a rare egg if we ever get one. Let's put a... We have... I think we have a slickster egg. We can stick in there. Two of them. Okay. Stick that in there. Priority 8, not 9. And this overheat damage stuff is going to drive me nuts. 
but we can't we can't really do anything with it except clear out the oil let's make a place for it all to go and then we'll can we drain this well we could drain it into here maybe let's use igneous rock not a high priority dig but uh, should I dig it at the bottom or the top? It doesn't matter, I don't think. So it should drain in here. And if it's not enough space, we can just make some more room for it. Actually, let's just do... Let's just do this. Yeah, and let them dig that out. Kind of want to cool down this area a bit so we can trap these slicksters. Because right now they won't... Uh, we can't get them. It's too hot in here to use a plastic trap or it'll melt. We could remove this abyss light and try to cool down this area with all this. We could just plant wheeze warts in here too. Let's try one, one wheeze wart near the top here. Right. Oh, it's too deep. Never mind. We could try one right here. Oh, it's 100 degrees here. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at that shine bug, see if it... Uh... Oh, we got petroleum. 60 degree petroleum. I set this to priority... Oh, priority 8. Let's make that 7. And we can hook up some more power there. Yeah, there's the natural gas. Kind of in the middle layer. At some point this will get too high pressure and we'll have to pump that all out of there. But for now, I think we'll just leave it. Oh, I was going to put a wheeze ward in here. How hot is it in here? 75. Got some molten iron in there that we could use eventually. Oxygen's still good. We got lots of sage eggs uh, piling up here. Let's uh, priorities. Let's see here. Combat. Let's let allow everyone to do combat. Standard. And let's uh, let's convert. Actually, the stone hatch we want. This stone hatch maybe not though. Let's get him. he was expecting maybe we should have left him oh he's dead oh and they just ate the meat i think <laughs> cooking up a storm here fried mushrooms food is like totally ample a million food that's ridiculous we should take on more dupes as long as we got enough oxygen now, I was running out of water earlier. This water down here was getting all used up, and then there's water up here that was getting used up. Oh, and I was going to stick someone in here. Who, who, oh, I was going to put... Who was I going to stick in there? Michael. Let's get in there. Get Michael's brain. I was supposed to do that last episode, but I never got around to it. Oh, there's a morb in there. <laughs> Any diseases? Oh, yeah. Uh, what do we want to do with this morb? Um, let's just clean his... Let's clean the air in there. And we'll set Michael in. He requested to go in there, so... Get his brain expanded. There he goes. He's gonna get some disease while he's in there. What do you get? Rock crusher. Rock crusher. Set that deodorizer up a bit. Now how are we doing for sand? 175 tons. At some point, we will run out of sand. 
and the Earth will stop rotating. The asteroid will stop rotating. Any promotions we can do? Oh yeah, Bear is ready to go. Stick Bear over here. Anyone else? Nope, not just yet. Okay, shine bug. Oh, no, it wasn't there. It was up here. Somewhere. Oh, it's still a shine bug. Waiting for it to become an egg. Lay an egg. There's no way to tell from this, though. So. Are there, are there germs in here? Oh, we tried to build this, but I didn't finish my ladder. Let's do a ladder up here. Clean that air out. And what else can we do here? We got polluted dirt all over the place. Now I got rid of the compost because I wanted to feed the polluted dirt to the... Actually, what was I going to... I forget what I was going to feed the polluted dirt to. Uh, I forget. I think it was one of the hatches, I think. But instead, I think I'll just uh, put my compost back. Because we don't want nasty... Yeah, nasty stuff all over the place. Nasty uh, dirt. We got like a little farm going on in here. There's no oxygen here. Did I shut that off? Yes, I did. Let's turn that back on. I forget why I did that. I think it was like super high pressure in here or something. These guys are all suffocating. I kind of don't want they, them in there. Let's, uh, let's get rid of this guy. And the baby, I'm sorry. Goodbye. Free meat. We're slaying the babies. It's an evil slaughterhouse. I just don't want uh, slime being dropped in there. I just want oxalate. Okay, we're doing exploratory mission up here. How did that go? Oh, we finish this little road here. And I guess keep going left. Probably go up this way as well. Okay, where do I want to end up? Uh, let's go straight through the center. Okay, I gotta finish my little power setup that I was doing here. So let's get rid of all this wire, I guess. We'll do it in stages here so we don't disconnect everything at once. Get rid of that first. And use conductive wire. And I think it's safe to get rid of this over here. But that should be fine. Get rid of all this, actually. Hopefully I don't forget to reconnect some things. And we'll just put it back in. The straight lines.
there. Jeez, I can't draw a straight line. Okay, there. And depending on how much power we left, we'll, we have left, we might go over here as well. Down to the pump, that's kind of important. So this coal generator, I don't think it's really necessary anymore. Instead of destroying it though, we'll dis disable that and the battery for now. Oh, something's very hot here. What's going on? Not quite sure. Oh, it's the iron, probably. Maybe. Might be the wiring. So let's get rid of this wiring. I'll just let them work on that. It'll eventually get hooked back up. We'll take a look at it in a bit, though. We got some regular eggs in there. Now, are there, should we cook up all the eggs we have? I'm really worried about... Whoa, what happened in here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no illumination. Critter starvation, dense puffed. Oh no, they have no. Oh, one of them got out. What the heck? How did he get out of there? Hopefully, he finds his way back in. Uh, oh yeah, I guess the. Why isn't this pump not running? Oh, not enough pressure. When does, when does this come back on? Next activity, 25 cycles. Hmm. What are we going to do for these guys? Starving. Oh no. Now if we open the door, all that oxygen should just rush in there. Hopefully, uh, yeah, actually let's just open that up. But we should put a lure in there. A flying, where is it? Critter lure. So that we can pull them back in once the oxygen gets in there. Stay in there, buddy. Stay in there. Come on, someone build this. Okay, we want phosphoride. Oh no, we don't, we want slime. And hopefully that'll keep them enticed. And I probably don't want them picking up that oxalate all the time. So we will, I, I had a container here for oxalate. Let's take that back off. No sense actually moving that just now. We'll just let it sit in there. And that will actually dissolve and feed them at a diminishing rate. Let's see if we can cook any eggs up. Did they finish this? No. Oh, they can't finish this. All this wiring is in the wrong place. Okay. Um, hmm. Because I built this on top of each other. Not good. I guess I'll just have to temporarily take out a few of these. And then we'll replace the wire and we'll put them back in. And I should probably finish off this room at some point. 
We're going to need a light here and a few more. I think someone mentioned that in a comment. Let's take a light there and a light there. I think this can go. I think all that polluted oxygen has been... Oh, I should have put the light here. That way the air can float. Okay, let's move that. Get rid of that. We're out of fertilizer again. I have a feeling all these sage hatches are eating it all up. Okay, we got a lot of eggs building up. Dracula egg, hatchling egg. Slickster larva egg. Okay, where's that? Is it? Oh, it's in the box. Let's stick that in the... Let's incubate that. Oh, we got a slickster here. Wild and happy. Perfect. I should put a door here so they can... So they're trapped in there. And I should actually seal this up. It's actually a bad place for the door. It should actually be here. Actually, we... Oh. He's going to get out, though. Well, they're going to get out anyway. Eh, we'll, we'll put the door there. It'll be fine. That should keep them contained. I don't think they can fly up all the way over. Maybe they can. Maybe they can. Hope they build this and don't trap the guys in there. Okay, let's move this vent down. So we can seal that room. Listen to them. They're like squeaking. Oh, I didn't want to kill that off. Let's put airflow here. That should be good. Now we're going to get some of those lava ones at some point. Which will heat up this area quite a bit. We'll have to see how that goes. Oh, we got two trapped in there. I think we should liberate those guys. Where should we go up? Let's go up this way. Igneous rock. Uh, let's go straight up there. And dig them, dig them out of there. Oh, and I found a geyser in here. It's a hot polluted oxygen vent. We could probably use that. We'd have to pipe it all the way up to the top. Which is probably not the best. Or we could just let it out gas and it would find its way up into the base. So let's do that. I think it'll just kind of find its way. We'll, maybe we'll make a path for it. It's going to be hot. But it's hot in here already, so that's fine. That's getting worked on. Any other eggs we want to preserve? Not really. So let's let's cook up the eggs that we have. Oh, we got... What do we have in here? Polluted oxygen. Oh, that's not good. In the base. Okay, we need another... Another compost. at a higher priority, so they actually work on it. What's this guy doing out of his pen? Baby hatch. You know what we're, you know what we're gonna do with him? Cute little babies. Free food. Oh, so, I'm a mean, terrible person.
It's the cycle of life. Okay, did they finish up all this power? No, I didn't even build it. Because we're waiting for them to remove it. Okay, put that in there. Kind of want one over there. Stick a lamp here. And we gotta put that food back. Oh, we can't put the food back in just yet. We gotta let them build all this. And I don't think they'll be able to build it all because there's stuff in the way, but we'll see. Let's take a look at our reports. It's been a while since I looked. Let's look at the previous day. Stress change. Oh, we got quite a bit of stress going on. Michael, Dylan, Dean. Disease status? No one. Travel time. Yeah, we could use some so we could use some tubes in the base. Let them fly around a bit. How are all these guys doing? Expecting, expecting. At this point, maybe we should just cook up their eggs. Take mushrooms off and put eggs in. Now, if I cook the shine bug egg again, I'll be really upset at myself. Or maybe we could just not cook the eggs. And just wait till they hatch and then we can turn them into meat. Let's do that instead. Safer. Much safer. Oh, I love their animations. Glum. We don't have enough ranchers for them. Okay, how's it going up here? We're using up that polluted water. Oh, we probably want more natural gas power. Actually, we still don't need it, even though I've hooked up all this stuff. So how much power draw? 490. Let's let's run all this stuff. Okay, let's get rid of this wire. And we'll hook it up with we'll add this circuit here. go from here and we need that filter and we'll just disable this if we ever need it again it's there in case the natural gas power goes offline which, is, which could happen Okay, I have run out of iron. Um, <laughs> and I kind of ran out of iron before they could build all that, which is bad because the iron is down here and they can't get down there. Uh, I guess they need their exosuits, so I'm going to have to cancel all this and actually rebuild it and turn it back on. Kind of hilarious. Let's just go straight through here. Kind of funny. Then we'll go get the iron. We gotta crack into this, uh, where is it? Geyser. Right here. Crack in here. Get the goods. Oh, it's going to be blistering hot. Oh, we can't even use it yet. We've got to cool it first. It's at 1400 degrees. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Uh, cancel all that. <laughs> okay, it's okay if those plants are offline for a while. Body temperature. What's so hot in here? Was it the wiring? Oh yeah. Oh no, melting point, temperature 35. Yeah, it was the wiring, I think. I'm gonna have to cool this down again. 
stick a weasel wart there. Weasel wart there. Oh boy. Okay, let's turn this back on. That's all powered up. Now they can go in and get the iron. And we don't want it to go into the base. We want to take it... Let's see if they do anything with it. It should be going down here. I had a container here. I think I got rid of it. I think it was right here. So let's stick a container back there. And we'll stick our molten iron in there. And it should just cool down. Actually, let's stick it in the water. It'll cool down even faster. Right down here. Then we'll mark that for iron. Look at this thing. <laughs> Didn't want all that heat to get out. That's why I did that. And how's this natural gas going? There's no power here. Oh, they just had to deliver the coal. Where did all this water come from? Hmm. From above. Get rid of that. Okay, that's not working very well. There we go. Petroleum is building up. That's good. Oh, all this heat is escaping. Okay, let's make this party nine. I just want to get this little bit done really quickly. Get her done. Okay, this is going to be iron. Priority nine. Actually, let's make it sweep only. That way we can control where they're getting it. Get that all out of there and then we can seal it back up. Until next time. Make sure they're taking it to the right place. Oh, the igneous rock. Oh, man. Don't want the igneous rock. Where are they taking that? That's probably going into the base. Oh no, they're taking it down here. Good. This is going to be molten hot down there, but that's okay down there. Hopefully they don't take... Oh, granite. Cancel sweeping. We don't want the granite. <laughs> Obsidian, we don't want that. Okay, hopefully the rest is iron. Oh, there's something else here. Obsidian. Don't want that. Hopefully that's just the iron. It'll go down and get cooled. Now, with a million calories of food, we're going to be okay for a while. Get some wheeze warts in here. We got lots of spare wheeze warts all over the map. That we could be using. It's going to take a while to cool down that iron, so I might skip ahead a bit here. Okay, someone dropped this iron ore here. Look at this. It's just blistering hot. So i got to sweep that up right away. 39. Look at it. Oh. How hot is that thing? 1300 degrees. Oh yeah, that's a good way to heat your base. Now, is there iron in here that I'm missing? Okay, that's been taken care of. This water is really driving me nuts. I don't know where it's coming from. So we're going to drain it here and put a little lip here so that it goes here. They probably dropped some ice or something. I'm not really sure where, the, where it came from. Unless I disconnected a pipe by mistake. I do have D 
deconstruct all, which is bad. degrees 50 degrees yeah it got hot here really quickly these guys are pretty warm too 38 degrees high body temperature <laughs> uh oh scalding what what the hell I think we have something oh yeah we got iron in this thing no uh refined metal no that's bad someone get this <laughs> sweep priority nine now how are they gonna sweep it <laughs> if it's that hot they're just moving it over oh geez okay Raw metal. I thought I got rid of all this a long time ago. No raw metal allowed. Sorry. Oh, I want raw metal. I don't. I don't refine metal. No refined metal. Big boo boo. Fine metal. No. Oh, look at it all. Oh, jeez. These are priority five. Why didn't they fill the ones down here? It's priority nine. Oh, I did raw metal. Jeez. You guys are probably like, what the hell is he doing? Okay, we're not going to do sweep only. We're just going to do all. Get all that iron there as quick as possible. And I've, I've overheated the base. <laughs> it's in every container here. Uh, we got iron in there. <laughs> Just a nice heater. Big giant heater. Did I miss any of them? Uh, I think so. Oh. Refined metal. Iron. Right, out of there. Oh yeah, it got really hot in here. No one is... Oh, they're picking it up and they're dropping it. Probably because it's molten hot. Oh, they can't pick it up. No! They can't move it. Oh no. Okay, this guy got it. Gotta get it out of the base. It's cooking the base. Okay, we need, uh, we need some cooling here really badly. This is a disaster. Okay, you know what? I don't want any storage here at all. Just get it out of the base. Get it. Get everything out of the base. <laughs> They're all scalding. What a disaster! Okay, I need to go get some more Weezworts. They're slowly getting rid of it, but... That was bad news. What do I have in these containers? Dirt, that's fine. 
Look at this. 1100 degrees. Ah. <laughs> okay, I had to put some more storage down here for all this hot iron. And it's kind of working. I kind of want to spread that heat out though, so I'm going to use some diamond temp shift plate. Probably should have used metal here, but. Now, oh, not priority nine. Seven is fine. And I put a bunch of Wii's warts in, or I was trying to. I, where are they? There we go. <laughs> I had a whole bunch on the map. I went and dug them up. So that should cool back down. As long as they come and get all that iron. And don't drop it all over the place. Look at all these guys. There's so many of them now. They're probably all expecting. Overcrowded and glum. Okay, let's uh... When morning comes, we'll... Oh, we gotta get rid of him. Yeah, we gotta thin the herd. It's a bit crazy. There's just too many of them. Okay. Are you... Out of there. Okay, let's get rid of a few of them here. Okay, still crowded? Yep. Oh no, what's going on with oxygen? Did I mess something up? We're missing a lot of oxygen. What's going on here? degrees no okay once this iron's gone I think it'll cool back down in here but is anyone like dying from the heat no not yet gonna get scalded okay there's only one piece left that should be it cool this place back down okay oh they dropped it Is our oxygen working as we expect? Yeah. It's just not quite enough. It's not, not high pressure enough in here. We should probably stop and start sealing up the base. Okay, that's sealed. This is no longer sealed. So let's let's seal that up. That's sealed. That is not sealed. Let's seal that up. Now I'm going to just build over top of these. Something like that. Because I might want to release some gases out of here later on. slime lung building up in here but it'll should die on clean oxygen but I think we need some deodorizers oh what's this what is this smooth hatchling egg that's our first that'll be our new refiner That's a first, people. Mark it in your your milestone record book. Someone suggested that I feed them either gold or wolframite. Oh, there's a lot of germs on that gold. So we could get uh, 
some of those new hatches. Now they'll become our new refiners because they're they turn raw metal into refined metal at a 75% versus this thing is uh, 50%. And we could use the metal refiner, but it is uh, it gets really hot. So now is this going to cool all this down? Maybe I'll move some of these down. In fact, do we have any extra wheeze warts? I dug up a bunch of them, so let's just see if we can put some more in. What are all these guys doing over here? Coal, granite, okay. And I should put an airlock here as well. Maybe right here. Uh, it would probably be better right here. So that'll be sealed. This is obviously not sealed. And it actually could be because we're pumping the CO2 down. Let's put an airlock here. Because they get in their suits there, that's all good. Oh, this is open. Okay, I didn't think that quite through. <laughs> uh, that's not going to do anything. Let's get rid of that. So seal this. And we'll put an airlock. Maybe right here. Oh, that's exposed. Okay, we'll seal that back up. I hope that water doesn't get in again. And get that airlock in there. So that should be sealed. That's all sealed. That is sealed. That is open. Let's close that up. We got all this oxygen here. I think I opened this because it was higher pressure oxygen here than here. Sealing up all those holes should help should help pressurize the base again. That's the theory. We solve this minor emergency. Do we have we oh we got five Weasworts. Let's just copy these settings here. Oh I can't build there. Once, uh, once it's cooled down, we'll take all these back out, of course. I almost forgot to seal up the volcano. So all that heat was spilling out. And it's causing our mushrooms to be too hot. But once they seal that up, it should be... Should cool back down. This area is cooling down slowly. Oh, it's getting too, all this heat spreading this way. And what's with the oxygen? Why is my oxygen so low? I don't understand. It was fine for so long. Oh, we're sending some down. That's bad. That's really bad. We only want CO2 to go down. Okay, maybe that's part of the problem. Uh, we need a filter there. <laughs> Big time. Okay, ventilation. Gas filter, priority 9. And... Granite is fine, so we'll go in here. And CO2 will go out. 
there. We'll do a bridge. Everything else, just stick back in the air. I think that'll work. And then we want a bridge. Granite's fine. To our CO2 line and back down yet. I don't know why I was sending oxygen down there. Kind of silly. Maybe I had a filter at one point and then I forgot I had it. Oh yeah, look at all this oxygen. That's the problem. Oh, that needs power. Oh no, it needs it needs iron. <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't, I shouldn't use iron. I should use, do I have anything else? Copper or copper. Let's use copper. That way we won't fry the base. And we want CO2. There we go. That should help with that problem. That is sealed. That is sealed. Sealed, sealed. Looks good. And this kind of bothers me. I kind of want to just dig that out properly. We'll let them do it whenever they get around to it. Same with this. Don't like that there. Oh no, look what happened. <laughs> they got out. Uh, contents none. Wait, oh, we have no slime to attract them. Okay, let's put a floor in here. That'll get some slime for them. Uh, priority eight. And they should be able to get back in through the door once we start attracting them. But I think I'll be wrapping up this episode. It's getting close to an hour here, so hope you enjoyed that. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.